What's going on everyone? Hey, so before I begin, first of all, there's going to be subtitles available in several different languages, so keep that in mind. Um, I wanted to get this ADF stuff out to as many people as possible, as many languages as possible. What we're going to be talking about here is the alternative display facility that takes up more than 40% of the daily volume and market share on an ongoing basis with absolutely zero trade reporting done on this thing. So basically the problem in the stock market, one of the big problems is the fact that most trades are done off exchange. This is a well-known thing. Dark pools have been brought up frequently in the past six months. Well, this is proof of that. If you look at this graph here, you see the difference, you see the, the gap, you see the two graphs on the top. Well, those are unfortunately dark pools. Now you see just how far below everything else is. Everything way down here is a lit exchange. You can just see just how much of a gap there is in the competition for market share. So the number one entity in the market, of course, is the ADF facility, accounting for 44.03% of yesterday's volume. Now, if you take this slider down here and you go back in time, you can tell this is not a new problem. This has been occurring since this graph and chart have been available as of early 20 or late 2015. And you can tell by expanding the graph that it's been doing nothing but increasing in market share. Now the problem is, again, we have an entity taking over 40% of market share and volume without anything being reported. Let's take a look at what I'm talking about. So this is what we just looked at here. I'm going to zoom in so everyone can see it. That's unrelated. Don't pay attention to that. That's actually a different one relating to yield curve. But basically, everything with an arrow pointing to it is a dark pool or off exchange. So when you add them all up together, and remember, this is consolidated volume across the entire market for all lit and unlit exchanges. So if you add up the dark pools, ADF being 44.03% plus the TRF Carteret, which is the second biggest entity for the past six years, 35%. TRF Chicago is really a non-factor, typically under half a percent. And then we have the NYSE TRF, which is trade reporting facility, which is 8.87%. So when you add all that up, off exchange percentage for yesterday and most days, 88.06%. Lit, only 55.97%. Now you might be asking, wait a minute, that's over 100%. Exactly. So the amount over the 100% mark always equals the ADF. For example, yesterday's amount, 144.03% total market share. Well, 44.03% of that was the ADF. So if you took the ADF out of it, it would be 100%. However, we know for a fact that there's volume occurring at the ADF facility because we can see right here that yesterday the ADF itself accounted for 4.46 billion shares of volume, making up a total 44% of the market. So this is where the SEC should be looking, if you ask me. So I hope you found this video helpful. This was a market share update for July 7th, 2021. Still no competition, still a broken market, Dark pools got to go. We need to get volume and liquidity back on the lit exchanges. If you thought this video was helpful, remember there is various languages available for subtitle to get this spread around. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you all next time.